factor using trial and error. x squared plus 100. Well, since it's a 1x squared, I only need to look at the factors of 100. So my factors of 100 are 1 and 100, 2 and 50, 4 and 25, 5 and 20, 10 and 10. Now I would need a pair, I would need the, those pairs to add up to, well there's an understood 0x here. 1 plus 100 is 101, 2 plus 50 is 52, 4 plus 25 is 29, 5 plus 20 is uh, 25, and 10 plus 10 is 20. None of them add up to 0. And if I put negatives on both of them, I would just get the opposites. So when a situation like this happens where you cannot find a pair of numbers that works, we would say that x squared plus 100 is called a prime polynomial. m squared plus 3m plus 24. Again, notice that we have a 1m squared, so focusing on the factors of 24. 1 and 24, 2 and 12, 3 and 8, 4 and 6. So they have a sum of 25, 14, 11, 10. There's no way I can get the 3 out of this, so m squared plus 3m plus 24 is also, I shouldn't put an equal sign there, it's not a correct statement. I'll just say that this is prime. 20x squared plus 30x plus uh, minus 15. Well, the first thing I would notice here is that we have a common factor of 5. So I'll write this as 5 by 4x squared plus 6x minus 3. Now, I'm, used, I'm asked to use trial and error, so I will. My possibilities for 4x squared are x and 4x and 2x and 2x. And my possibilities for 3 are 1 and 3. So here's where, you know, trial and error might not be such a bad idea. So let's, let's don't forget to bring that 5 down. Let's try the x and the 4x first. So let's put a 1, let's put the 1 here and the 3 here. That would give me a 4x, a 3x and a 4x. But now, wait a second, this is a minus, so I know I have to have different signs. So when I have different signs, that means I need a difference. So 3x and 4x have a difference of 1x. Okay, so no good. Let's switch it up. Let's put the 3 here and the 1 here. So that would give me a 1x and a 12x. And they have a difference of 11, so no good. Alright, so I know it's not the x and the 4x. So it must be 2x and 2x with 1 and 3. Two x times three is six x. One times two x is two x. So that has a difference of four x. So that doesn't work either. So we cannot factor that any further. And so we would we would have to stop here. All right. That's as far as we can factor. The, the remaining quadratic, the four x squared plus six x minus three, that polynomial is prime, and so we would stop there at 5 times 4x squared plus 6x minus 3.